Today is 39 days of eating just meat with like 99.9%. .9%. I'd say good following the rule of just eating meat and animal products. Uh, I had cheese a couple times and I did dabble in ketchup and barbecue sauce. Turns out I can't have those. So after taking two weeks and super sensitizing my body, I added ketchup and my body had a reaction and I've challenged it a couple times since then. And yeah, so I think it's actually a nightshades issue because I've already been sensitive to potatoes and spices, especially mixed spices, so often I have a reaction to them. And I thought for a long time that it was the salt or soy or something in it. But now looking at the labels of the spices, a lot of them have nightshades. Like paprika is a nightshade. Um, so yeah, it's been a journey. 39 days of just eating meat. Um, in the beginning, it was really hard. And there are some really hard days. But now that I'm at day 39, I'm having a lot of conversations with myself about what my future looks like. What does how I eat in the future look like? Because I feel really good. And now that I've been like off of nightshades now for, I'd say officially it's been probably six days. My body just released today at like three pounds of water weight. It's just like came off of my body, my rings loosened up. So one of the things I always know how the inflammation in my body is doing is how my rings fit. And they've been, my fingers have still been swollen, even on carnivore. And I was like, I don't understand why is this happening. But now that I'm officially off the nightshades for six days, it was just like, my rings are spinning on my finger. Like, it's wild what has happened. And so now I have to ask myself, what does my future look like? Is it carnivore? Um, because when I started this, that wasn't my intention. Um, or is it ketovore? And I, I suspect it's going to be somewhere in that ketovore category. Finding foods that do work for my body, that taste delicious, that add a little bit of variety. Um, yeah, I'm going to make a video maybe tomorrow morning and put it up on my YouTube channel. Kind of really diving deep into what what this has been like the things that i've noticed in my body because there isn't three minutes it's just not enough time to really dig into this experience